Welcome guys to Christ the Servant Lutheran Church's Sunday School Youth Corner. Hi everybody. an outstanding Sunday School video for you guys today. So many of your church family have pitched in to make this video and it is absolutely awesome. I know I say that a lot but this movie is awesome. We have so many special guests in this movie. So some of you guys are getting promoted and some of you are moving up and a lot of you are graduating. Yay! So this week in this video has so much in it. We've got Memorial Day. We've got gratitude jars. We've got the Bible scripture reading. We've got amazing things to honor you. So stay tuned and watch this movie. Oh, and parents, make sure you have the tissues. The scripture reading today is from John chapter 17 verses 1 through 11. Jesus prays for you and me. Thank you, Abigail and James, for reading this. John 17 verses 1 through 11. After Jesus had spoken these words to his disciples, he looked up to heaven and said, Father, the hour has come. Glorify your Son, so that the Son may glorify you, since you have given him authority over all people to give eternal life to all whom you have given him, and this is eternal life, that they may know you, the only true God, and Jesus Christ whom you have sent. I glorified you on earth by finishing the work that you gave me to do. So now, Father, glorify me in your own presence. With the glory I had in your presence before the world existed, I have made your name known to those whom you gave me from the world. They were yours, and you gave them to me, and they have kept your word. Now they know that everything you have given me is from you. For the words that you gave me I have given to them, and they have received them and know in truth that I came from you, and they have believed that you sent me. I am asking on their behalf. I am not asking on behalf of the world, but on behalf of those whom you have gained me, because they are yours. All mine are yours, and yours are mine, and I have been glorified in them. And now I am no longer in the world, but they are in the world, and I am coming to you. Holy Father, protect them in your name that you have given me, so that they may be one, as we are one. Great job reading the scriptures, James and Abigail. This Memorial Day, we remember and honor those who gave the ultimate sacrifice. As we express our gratitude, we must never forget that the highest appreciation is not to utter the mere words, but to live by them. President John F. Kennedy said this. It's Christ the Servant's Gratitude Jar time. Show us those jars.
All right, go guys. Show me the fun things you have done this week. Servant Lutheran Church. We want to congratulate you on your last day of school. We know this isn't what you wanted or how you could imagine this last day would be. But we want to celebrate you for finishing up the school year. We want to honor you for your dedication, perseverance, grades, outstanding citizenship, perfect attendance, and promoting you on to bigger and better things. You guys are bright, shining lights that nobody can put out. Even when doing online schoolwork all day, you manage to continue to make others smile. And be good Samaritans in your own homes. There is no doubt this pandemic has and will shape you. 
You have worked hard all year, and when faced with adversity, you continued to show God's love the rest of the year. You guys are living and making history that future generations will read about. This is showing how strong and amazing you all are. We are so proud of you. We want to congratulate you on your last day of school, but the first day of your new adventures. Congratulations to our preschoolers and our preschool graduates. Congratulations to the kindergarten graduates. Congratulations to our first graders and our second graders. Congratulations to our third and fourth graders on moving up. Congratulations to our fifth grade graduates. You did it! Congratulations to our sixth and seventh graders on moving up! Congratulations to our 8th grade graduates. You did it, and you are more than ready for high school. Go get them!
congratulations to our 9th, 10th, and 11th graders. You guys are rocking it. Seniors, the world is yours. You did it. Jeremiah 29, chapter 11. For I know the plans I have for you, says the Lord. They are plans for the good, not disaster, for your future and hope. the Servant Lutheran Church, youth, you did it. You are moving up and you are moving on. And may the Lord bless you and keep you. And may the Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. Let us bow our heads and pray. Dear God, we pray for our youth. We lift them up before you. They are a gift to us and to many others. And during this season of new beginnings, we ask that you would make their way clear. We ask that you would keep their footsteps firm and remind them that you are with them always. 
May they sense the freshness of your spirit over their lives in amazing ways. May they be strengthened and stilled with hope for the new roads you have in store. We thank you in advance for all you have in store for this day, for this year, for their lives. I will always pray through Jesus, our friend, our Lord, and our Savior. Amen. So you guys did it! Yay! Congratulations! We are so happy for you. And on behalf of Christ's Servant Lutheran Church, awesome job, you guys. Everyone, have a safe, wonderful week. Continue to show God's love as you always do. Enjoy the summer. Have fun and send me those pictures. See everybody next week. Bye.